Hi guys, this is Toy Time Daily, and today I'm going to be doing another Poké review. Well, my other one is still uploading because I want to just get them out as soon as possible because I think they'll be a great series and you guys will like them. So I just want to give you guys the best I can. So today we got Venusaur from Heart Gold Soul Silver. Now Heart Gold Soul Silver was my favorite set, especially the one with the primes. And this one, this Venusaur, I have no idea how I got it. I think I got it from a deck box. But it's a pretty good card. Because it's green aroma makes it so that you remove all special conditions from each of your grass type Pokemon. And each of your grass type Pokemon can't be affected by special conditions. By any of them. So then Desperate Pollen is 1 for 30, which is good, kind of like Crobat Prime. Desperate Pollen is, if Venusaur already has 8 or more damage counters on it, the defending Pokemon is now burned, confused, and poisoned. In a special reaction, if the defending Pokemon is affected by any special conditions, the attack does 40 damage plus 40 more damage for each of those special conditions. So you can do a maximum, if you got Desperate Pollen off, and got the things, you could get a really high 160 damage. That is huge. That can beat Tyranitar Prime in one hit. It's just overpowered. It can beat Shadow Lugia in two. And they'll lose two things, lose two, or is it three? Three... 30 damage each turn, and they'll be confused. So, its weakness is pretty high for a heart gold. It's fire plus 40, and its retreat cost is even more than Tyranitar, which is 4. So, low 55 comes from Ivysaur. Tough Ivysaur. Can't really see him that much. Sorry, my camera's terrible. Yeah, there he is. He's also a holographic. If I can pick him up and show you. See there, he is a holographic card. Yeah, thanks for watching my second video of Poke Review. See you in the next video. Bye!